Hi, I'm Deborah Klein, the Registered Dietitian and Health Director with Organic Liaison. Here's my week number 23, Dietitian Tips. My topic is how to get rid of dry skin. Getting a lot of requests, what do I do for dry skin? It's very irritating, being all itchy and red on your hands. And thankfully, we can do a lot with what we put in our body. What we put in our body affects our skin. First of all, drink lots of water. Keep sipping water all day. And eat foods with high water content, such as bell peppers, cucumbers, lettuce, choose organic, eat those melons, the watermelon, cantaloupe. So eat the high water content foods to keep yourself well hydrated, prevent the dry skin. And also eat vitamin C foods. Vitamin C is important for collagen integrity, so for our skin integrity. So keep that collagen good and strong by eating vitamin C foods such as papaya, broccoli, kiwi, cauliflower, cantaloupe, the berries, oranges, lemons. So eat vitamin C and also supplement with some vitamin C. So like a 500 milligram supplement, 500 milligram capsule to make sure you're getting that important antioxidant vitamin C for your skin integrity. Also vitamin E. So wheat germ, nuts, spinach, kale, broccoli, you want to have those vitamin E foods also. I don't recommend supplementing with vitamin E. There's some correlation with excess vitamin E can increase risk for stroke. So eat your vitamin E, have that wheat germ, have the nuts, and then also have omega-3 fatty acids. Omega-3 fatty acids are important for anti-inflammation, so anti-inflammatories. We don't want that inflammation, that redness. So increase your anti-inflammatories in your body. So have omega-3 foods such as chia seeds, shelled hemp seeds, the ground flax seed, fish, so the salmon, herring, I don't like herring, but it's very good for omega-3s, and sardines, and also take some fish oil capsules, or if you're vegan, have the omega-3 capsules. And also watch out your sugar intake. Sugar intake Excess sugar increases your insulin, which increases inflammatory chemicals. So if you are going to have a sweet, balance it out with some protein. But try to reduce your sweets, your sugar, if you're having a lot of dry skin, skin irritation. And reduce your stress. Stress increases cortisol, which increases our insulin production because of the increase in sugar level from the cortisol. And that causes inflammation. So definitely relax. If you're finding you have a lot of that eczema, itchy skin, you probably are stressed out. So reduce your stress as much as you can. Relax. Do the stress management techniques. And then also watch out for the fried foods. Those fried foods definitely dry out our skin. So we don't want fried foods. Eat more fruits, vegetables. Have those omega-3s. Have the vitamin E, the vitamin C and drink lots of water, and you'll have nice, healthy, moisturized skin.